Hello and welcome to our channel, where we share with you tips and tricks on how to improve your life and achieve your goals. In today's video, we're going to dive into the world of motivational quotes and explore 10 powerful quotes that can boost your confidence and help you overcome self-doubt. Confidence is the ability to trust oneself and one's capabilities of reaching a goal. It's also one of the most important skills you can develop in life, because it affects everything from your personal relationships to your career success. But confidence is not something that you're born with or that you have or don't have. It's something that you can build and cultivate over time, by changing your mindset, your habits, and your actions. So if you're feeling low on confidence right now, or if you just need a little reminder of how awesome you are, then this video is for you. I've selected 10 inspiring quotes from some of the most successful and influential people in history, who have faced their own challenges and fears, and who have learned to believe in themselves and their potential. These quotes will help you understand your self-worth, overcome your insecurities, and empower you to take action towards your dreams. So without further ado, let's get started with the first quote. 1. No one can make you feel inferior without your consent. Eleanor Roosevelt. This quote is from Eleanor Roosevelt, the former First Lady of the United States, who was also a diplomat, a human rights activist, and a leader of the women's movement. She was known for her courage, her intelligence, and her independence. She once said that she had to overcome the fear of being public every day of her life. What this quote means is that you have the power to choose how you react to other people's opinions and judgments. You don't have to let them define you or limit you. You don't have to give them permission to make you feel bad about yourself. You can choose to ignore them, or to use them as motivation to prove them wrong. You can choose to focus on your own strengths, values, and goals, rather than on what others think of you. So the next time someone tries to put you down or make you doubt yourself, remember this quote and don't let them get to you. You are the only person who can decide your worth, and you are worthy of respect, love, and happiness. 2. To be yourself in a world that is constantly trying to make you something else is the greatest accomplishment. Ralph Waldo Emerson. This quote is from Ralph Waldo Emerson, one of the most influential American writers and philosophers of the 19th century, which emphasized individualism, self-reliance, and intuition. He encouraged people to follow their own path and their own voice, rather than conforming to society's expectations. What this quote means is that you should embrace your uniqueness and authenticity, rather than trying to fit in or please others. You should be proud of who you are, what you stand for, and what you have to offer. You should not compare yourself to others or try to be someone else. You should not let anyone tell you how to live your life or what to do with it. Being yourself is not always easy, especially in a world that is constantly bombarding you with messages about how you should look, act, think, or feel. But being yourself is also the most rewarding thing you can do for yourself and for others. Because when you are yourself, you are free, happy, and fulfilled. And when you are yourself, you attract the right people who appreciate you for who you are. So the next time you feel pressured or tempted to change yourself for someone else's sake, remember this quote and stay true to yourself. You are the greatest achievement of your life. 3. To overcome fear is the quickest way to gain your self-confidence. Roy T. Bennett. This quote is from Roy T. Bennett, a best-selling author and motivational speaker who writes about personal growth, happiness, and success. He is also the creator of the Light in the Heart blog, where he shares his insights and wisdom with millions of readers around the world. What this quote means is that fear is one of the biggest obstacles to confidence. Fear of failure, fear of rejection, fear of criticism, fear of uncertainty. These fears can hold you back from pursuing your goals, from expressing your opinions, from trying new things, from being yourself. These fears can make you doubt your abilities, your worth, and your potential. But the only way to overcome fear is to face it to do the thing that scares you, to take the risk, to step out of your comfort zone, to challenge yourself, to learn from your mistakes, to grow from your experiences. Because when you overcome fear, you realize that you are stronger, smarter, and more capable than you thought. You realize that you can handle anything that comes your way. You realize that you have nothing to lose and everything to gain. So the next time you feel afraid of doing something, remember this quote and do it anyway you will gain confidence in yourself and in your abilities. 4. There are ups and downs, but whatever happens, you have to trust and believe in yourself, Luka Modric. This quote is from Luka Modric, one of the best soccer players in the world, who plays for Real Madrid and the Croatian national team. He is known for his vision, creativity, and leadership on the field. 
He has won numerous awards and trophies, including the Ballon d'Or, the FIFA World Cup Golden Ball, and the UEFA Champions League. But his success was not easy or smooth. He had to overcome many challenges and hardships in his life, such as growing up in a war torn country, being rejected by several clubs for being too small and weak, and facing criticism and doubts from fans and media. What this quote means is that life is not a straight line. It's a roller coaster. It has highs and lows, joys and sorrows, victories and defeats. But whatever happens, you have to trust and believe in yourself. You have to have faith in your abilities, your talents, and your dreams. You have to have confidence in your decisions, your actions, and your outcomes. Because when you trust and believe in yourself, you can overcome any obstacle, any setback, any failure. You can bounce back from any disappointment, any loss, any mistake. You can achieve anything you set your mind to. So the next time you face a challenge or a difficulty in your life, remember this quote and trust and believe in yourself. You have what it takes to succeed. 5. Each time we face our fear, we gain strength, courage, and confidence in the doing. Theodore Roosevelt. This quote is from Theodore Roosevelt, the 26th President of the United States, who was also a soldier, a historian, a naturalist, and a Nobel Peace Prize winner. He was one of the most popular and influential presidents in American history, who led the country through major reforms and innovations. He was also a man of action, who lived by his motto, speak softly and carry a big stick. He was not afraid of taking risks or facing challenges. He was not afraid of speaking his mind or standing up for his principles. He was not afraid of living his life to the fullest. What this quote means is that facing our fear is not only necessary but beneficial. It's not only a way to overcome it but a way to grow from it. It's not only a way to survive but a way to thrive. Because each time we face our fear, we gain strength to endure it. We gain courage to confront it. We gain confidence to overcome it. So the next time you feel fear holding you back from doing something, remember this quote and face it anyway. You will gain strength, courage, and confidence in the doing. 6. Confidence is directness and courage in meeting the facts of life. John Dewey. This quote is from John Dewey, one of the most influential American philosophers and educators of the 20th century. He was a pioneer of pragmatism, a philosophy that emphasizes practicality, experience, and action. He was also a leader of progressive education, a movement that advocated for student-centered, experiential, and democratic learning. What this quote means is that confidence is not a vague or abstract concept. It's not a feeling or a state of mind. It's not something that you have or don't have. It's something that you do or don't do. Confidence is directness and courage in meeting the facts of life. It's being honest and realistic about your situation, your challenges, and your opportunities. It's being brave and bold in facing your problems, your fears, and your goals. It's being proactive and decisive in taking action, making choices, and creating solutions. Confidence is not something that you wait for or wish for. It's something that you work for and earn. So the next time you want to be more confident, remember this quote and be direct and courageous in meeting the facts of life. You will be confident in doing so. 7. Stop acting so small. You are the universe in ecstatic motion. Rumi. This quote is from Rumi, one of the most famous and beloved poets of all time. He was a 13th century Persian mystic, who wrote about love, spirituality, and the meaning of life. His poems are widely read and admired across cultures and religions. What this quote means is that you should stop limiting yourself and your potential. You should stop doubting yourself and your worth. You should stop hiding yourself and your gifts. You are not small. You are not insignificant. You are not powerless. You are the universe in ecstatic motion. You are part of the infinite and eternal creation. You are endowed with immense and unique abilities. You have the power to create, to change, to inspire, to love. You have the purpose to live, to learn, to grow, to serve. You have the joy to explore, to discover, to express, to celebrate. You are not here to act small. You are here to be yourself. So the next time you feel small or insecure, remember this quote and stop acting so small. You are the universe in ecstatic motion. 8. One important key to success is self-confidence. An important key to self-confidence is preparation. Arthur Ashe. This quote is from Arthur Ashe, one of the greatest tennis players of all time, who was also a civil rights activist, a humanitarian, and a writer. 
He was the first black player to win the men's singles titles at Wimbledon, the US Open, and the Australian Open. He was also the first black man to be ranked number one in the world. He faced many obstacles and challenges in his life, such as racism, discrimination, and health issues. He contracted HIV from a blood transfusion during a heart surgery, and later died from AIDS-related pneumonia. He was a role model and an inspiration for many people around the world. What this quote means is that confidence and success are closely related. Confidence is not only a result of success, but also a cause of it. Confidence helps you perform better, achieve more, and enjoy more. But confidence is not something that you can fake or force. It's something that you can build and boost. And one of the best ways to do that is through preparation. Preparation is the process of getting ready for a task, a challenge, or a goal. It's doing your research, your homework, your practice. It's planning your strategy, your steps, your resources. It's anticipating your obstacles, your risks, your opportunities. Preparation helps you increase your knowledge, your skills, and your experience. It helps you reduce your uncertainty, your anxiety, and your mistakes. It helps you improve your performance, your results, and your satisfaction. Preparation gives you confidence. Confidence gives you success. So the next time you want to be more confident and successful, remember this quote and prepare yourself well. You will be confident and successful in doing so. 9. You are the only person on earth who can use your ability. Zig Ziglar. This quote is from Zig Ziglar, one of the most popular and influential motivational speakers and authors of the 20th century. He wrote over 30 books on personal development, salesmanship, leadership, and success. He inspired millions of people with his speeches, seminars, and programs. What this quote means is that you have a unique and valuable ability that no one else has. You have a combination of talents, skills, passions, and experiences that make you who you are. You have something to offer to the world that no one else can. But you are also the only person on earth who can use your ability. You are the only person who can discover it, develop it, and deploy it. You are the only person who can decide how to use it, when to use it, and where to use it. You have the responsibility to use your ability. You have the opportunity to use your ability. You have the potential to use your ability. Using your ability is not only good for you, but also good for others. It helps you fulfill your purpose, achieve your goals, and express your creativity. It helps you serve others, solve problems, and make a difference. Using your ability is the best way to be confident and happy. So the next time you doubt yourself or your ability, remember this quote and use your ability. You are the only person on earth who can use your ability. 10. Believe you can and you're halfway there. Theodore Roosevelt. This quote is from Theodore Roosevelt, the 26th President of the United States, who was also a soldier, a historian, a naturalist, and a Nobel Peace Prize winner. He was one of the most popular and influential presidents in American history, who led the country through major reforms and innovations. He was also a man of action, who lived by his motto, speak softly and carry a big stick. He was not afraid of taking risks or facing challenges. He was not afraid of speaking his mind or standing up for his principles. He was not afraid of living his life to the fullest. What this quote means is that believing in yourself and your abilities is half the battle. It's the first and most important step towards achieving anything you want in life. It's the foundation of your confidence and your success. Because when you believe you can, you activate your potential. You unlock your power. You unleash your creativity. When you believe you can, you motivate yourself. You inspire yourself. You empower yourself. When you believe you can, you attract opportunities. You overcome obstacles. You achieve results. Believing you can is not only a mindset, but also a habit. It's something that you can practice and improve every day, by affirming yourself, by challenging yourself, by rewarding yourself. Believing you can is not only a choice, but also a responsibility. It's something that you owe to yourself, to your dreams, to your destiny. Believing you can is the best way to be confident and successful. So the next time you want to do something or achieve something, remember this quote and believe you can. You're halfway there. That's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed these 10 powerful quotes to boost your confidence and help you overcome self-doubt. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. And don't forget to comment below and let me know which quote resonated with you the most. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.